Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Juliet and this is my channel, Mama Tried. Today I have a few things that I need to leave the house for. And so I figured that we would bring you along with us. What do you think? Are you ready to go bye-bye? What happened to your bow? Yes, bye-bye, you're right. I also forgot to mention that someone is in a big girl car seat now. So she has a place for her cup. <gasps> and a place to put her toes, I guess. She doesn't like to sit still for long, so let's roll. So, I woke up this morning and I decided that Luxie and I needed to go out and get some fresh air. So, we are going to the park. It doesn't look like it's supposed to rain even though it is like extremely humid. And I got some new things for the stroller that I wanted to try out. I'm about to play baby shark. So she'll get happy and I will see you guys at the park. Okay, so we are here at the park and I have one specific parking spot that like no one ever parks in and someone is parked there today, so thanks a lot. It is a lot more windy outside than I thought it was going to be today. Is that funny? <gasps> <No. gasps> You're funny. I took a break from our walk to show you Luxie's stroller setup. So this is the Evenflow Pivot Travel System stroller. And I got this stroller bag from Lupant. I really love it. It has so many different pockets and places to put toys. That is a little wristlet that can detach. And when you flip it over, you can actually pop the back off and hold it like it's got a little strap. And so that's a good place to put money. It's got two cup holders, so one for me, one for Luxie, and an insulated little area you could put snacks in. I just have my phone in it for now. And I also love the additional little pocket up top. And it comes with two straps so you could actually carry it like a bag if you needed to. So that way you don't have to leave it on the stroller. It's super convenient. I also got her little fan off of Amazon. I love it. It is super powerful for what it is and it can just recharge. I actually have a charger in my car for it. So it's really convenient. And I love that the legs move around so easily so you can attach it to basically anything. During our walks, I like to get some squats in, so normally I'll stop and do a couple of squats. Luxie does not like to stay still for too long, so I have to do it really fast. Obviously, this is sped up, so you guys don't have to watch the whole thing, but I was doing it pretty fast. <laughs> I just wanted to show you guys real quick how easy it is to attach the straps and carry this like a bag if you need to. They did send me this bag, but this is not a sponsored video. I just really love it. We're gonna go inside, eat some breakfast, and then I'll let Luxie play for a little bit and then it'll be her nap time. So I guess I'll bring you guys along with me. <laughs> Some days I eat breakfast, some days I don't. Today's one of those days because I'm just not that hungry. So I drink iced coffee and how I make my iced coffee, um, keto style or like low carb style, these little coffee pods from Aldi. I mean, you could use any coffee pods. 
but I literally make like a full size cup of coffee in the Keurig. I either put it in the fridge and wait for it or I literally make a pitcher at a time and then keep it in the fridge. But this morning um, I just made a cup and then I put it in the fridge and then I added this hazelnut sugar-free creamer and I added regular whole milk. I don't usually like whole milk. I normally do like um, almond milk or something, but I didn't have any almond milk, so that's what I used. And then I just add a little bit of stevia to it, and it's perfect. I actually prefer like a caramel creamer, but that one does the job, and so good. That's my breakfast of the day. So I usually meal prep for Luxie. I have a breakfast casserole that I make at the beginning of the week and then she eats that throughout the week. And it's got sausage, egg, cheese, and vegetables in there. Um, I didn't have any spinach this time, so it's just sausage, egg, and cheese, and like some spices. I normally give her half a banana. She loves banana. And some kind of other fruit, like strawberries and blueberries or cantaloupe, just whatever I have on hand. The easiest way for me so far for meal prepping is to get something like a cantaloupe or a watermelon and cut it all up into bite-sized pieces for her. And that way I've got snacks, I've got a side for pretty much every meal and it's healthy and she loves it. I'm gonna go ahead and cut up some of that casserole. And here is a half of a banana. I know it looks really gross, but this is how I do it. <laughs> kind of weird but I fold it over like so that way I don't waste a baggie or something because she only eats half at a time so like whenever I take the half I'll start folding over the pieces of the banana and then I'll stick a toothpick in it so that way I'm not wasting a plastic bag or like a baggie on it for no reason and if it gets brown like that on the top because the air has hit it or whatever I'll just cut that piece off See, I just cut that piece off and this banana is perfect. This is the breakfast <laughs> casserole and I just pop it in the microwave for like 10 seconds. I'm gonna put her in her high chair so we can get ready to eat. <laughs> Turn it off. Turn it off. Good job. Yay.
<laughs> you are silly. Oh! guys I think that's gonna be the end of today's video but he's looking kind of sleepy so it might be nap time so that pretty much concludes our morning routine if we don't go on a walk in the mornings then we try to spend some time outside walking around or sitting outside or playing or reading every day is different we don't necessarily do this same routine every single day so it's kind of hard to have a strict morning routine she normally eats breakfast between 9.30 and 10 and takes a nap between 11 and sometimes up to like 2.30, 2 o'clock. So it really all depends on the day and right now she's getting her bottom molars. So she's really fussy and not having it a lot of the time. So we kind of adjust the schedule as we need to. But thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you are interested in purchasing the Lupinette stroller bag that I showed you guys, I will link that down below or the stroller fan or her sippy cup. Any of the things that we took today with us on our walk, I'll try to link them down below for you. And if you like any of the things in her playroom, let me know and I'll try to link those for you as well because a lot of these things came from Amazon. I think that's pretty much everything. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel for more of my videos. And let me know down below in the comments if you like videos like this, if you wanna see more things like this. And make sure you follow me over on Instagram. My Instagram handle is Mama Tried Official. I'm also doing a giveaway on my channel until I reach 1,000 subscribers, so make sure that you check out that video so you can do all the things to enter the giveaway. I'll be giving away a $50 Amazon gift card. So thank you so much for watching, and have an awesome day. Bye. Say bye-bye. Yay. Bye-bye. <laughs>